Alright, what is going on YouTube? Fox here, welcome to you guys here with a brand new video, and I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. So, I got some bad news, man. So, last week, I came on Black Ops 2, and I had heard from Fortunate and a couple other people that Black Ops 2 servers have been fixed, and that the mods in the theater were gone, and all this other stuff. Well, apparently this is a bug that goes on in Black Ops 2, and it happens every couple months, and it only lasts about a couple days, because now I'm getting a lot of comments saying that the servers aren't fixed and all this other stuff, so we're gonna check it out today, and I have a really bad feeling that, that the servers are just completely messed up now, and that the theater mods are back. So I hope you guys do enjoy. We are very close to 97,000 subscribers and we're on the road to 100,000 subscribers as well so if you guys are brand new here you guys like black ops 2 you guys like modern warfare 2 all those throwback call of duties and you guys like the new call of duties like modern warfare and all that stuff make sure you guys subscribe turn on notifications and honestly i'll make you guys a bet if you guys can hit 100 likes on this video actually you know what no if you guys can hit 50 likes then i'll go play bo2 plutonium apparently that's a lot more playable than this game is on the 360 or the xbox one or ps3 or whatever 50 likes and I'll go play BO2 Plutonium because apparently that's a lot more playable. So, without further ado, let's go, bro. Also, today's the last day to use code FOXY for 30% off your G Fuel products. If you guys want to support me even further as a content creator, go over to gfuel.com down in the description and use code FOXY and get the brand new Sour Faceberry flavor. I've heard it's really good. Honestly, I'm not really sure if we're even going to run into people with mods in this game, but, you know, we shall see, I guess one guy so i wanted to talk about a couple things and it's kind of mind-blowing but then again it's not really mind-blowing because this game is black ops 2 it's so beloved by so many people and things like that so um i'm gonna be real with you definitely expected a lot of people to come back to black ops 2 once the servers got fixed for those couple days and whatnot however i did not expect the, the game to completely change and for the game to have thirty thousand people on it around like 1 p.m. At, at one point. That's insane. Oh my, the servers are so laggy right now. Oh my lord. So I got a comment last week from someone that said that Black Ops 2 had 30,000 people on it at one point. That's crazy, bro. That's and it was around like 1 p.m. And there was 30,000 people on the game. 30,000 on an eight-year-old game. That's just insane to me. Never a doubt. Good job. Well, we lose to no scopies matchmaking isn't a thing in this game. So after I made last week's video, the servers crashed. And actually, they crashed during my recording session. If you guys watched last week's video, then you guys saw how the servers disconnected at the end of the video. Well, they were down for almost 24 hours. I don't really know why they were down for 24 hours. I'm going to assume that they were down because there were so many people on the servers. I feel like that's a little bit of a stretch, but you never know. Like, that could have been the case. I'm just, like, picking up random guns because I feel like just using the same weapons I used in the last video is pretty boring to watch. So, <laughs> yeah, my bad. And I'll be real with you. I am super surprised that the servers went down. I I'm surprised there was 30,000 people. I expect it maybe like maybe 10 or 15,000, but 30,000? Holy shnikes, bro. That's an insane number. And I said in last week's video, I was just like, you know, why? Like, why? Well, why do it now? Why fix Black Ops 2 now of all times? I had people give me crazy theories in the comments going, well, I think it's because they want people to play the, the Treyarch game because they, they want, they, they have the new game that's coming out this year. And I was just kind of like, I don't think so. It's actually crazy playing with aim assist right now, too. I think I said that in my last video. Go, got a UAV. Another reason I want to play BO2 Plutonium is because uh, I really want to play with FOV. Honestly, the game looks beautiful. BO2 Plutonium looks amazing. So nice. Graphics are amazing. They look incredible. Oh, we got a hit mark. That sucks. That just shows you how powerful the DSR is. I, th I feel like pre patch that would have gotten a kill. Nice. 
Sticks. Friendly UAV inbound. Contact with weapon. Want to get paid? Move it. That's, that's laggy, bro. It's a, it's a real shame. It's a shame that this game can't get rid of its modders. It's a shame that people don't respect this game a little bit more. I'm actually super surprised I haven't run into any modders. And you know, I'm gonna be real with you guys. I know that a lot of you guys enjoy the Black Ops 2 content. And that's another reason why I just like wanted to make a Black Ops 2 video, to be honest. Put that right there. Hold on. Yeah, I figured that would get somebody. Okay, yeah, let's lay Bouncing Betty. I got killed by Larry Bird's mom. Damn, Larry Bird's mom knows how to play Black Ops 2. You kidding me, bro? That's crazy. This is such a good camo, bro. Party Rock is so good. Such a good camo. Brought back in Black Ops 4, too. It was even really nice in that game, too. Love that. Guys, let me know down in the comments, what's your favorite weapon in Black Ops 2? This is this is supposed to be a RIP Black Ops 2 video, but uh, I haven't really run into any modders, so I don't really know what to do. <laughs> oh, drone? Ugh. Gross. Yo, thank you, whoever just did that. So where does drone rank in being one of the worst maps in COD history? Just curious, where does it rank? I feel like it's definitely top five of worst COD maps of all time. I was gonna say, bro, there ain't no way that he just survived that. Really, bro? That's so shitty. <laughs> Not gonna lie, parts of me wants to go back and go on BO3 and grab someone's account and go make a video on the XMC. If you guys want me to do that, let me know down in the comments. Hold on. Wait for this guy to come through. Yep, he's dead. Two, thank you. Jesus, bro, don't scare the shit out of me like that. Jesus, what? That lag though, bro. Holy shnikes. Game get the I can't get streaks, bro. I'm choking them, man. Oh, there, there's that that's another thing, I guess. So apparently back when uh BO2 kind of got quote unquote fixed or whatever for those couple days, apparently all the sweats came out and they started playing Black Ops 2 again. Which is by no surprise. I'm not surprised by that at all. To be honest, I'd much rather have sweats. Then have modders coming into the game personally, but it's it's crazy how just a couple of videos saying that Black Ops 2 is fixed brought out 30,000 players and brought out a bunch of sweats. <laughs> I think that also shows to this game's uh, stature and how I guess how much it's loved that people who haven't played this game in a long, long time are willing to come out and play it. Oh, my God, that streak. God damn, bro. Stop fucking jumping every single time you see somebody, bro. And, like, it lags, too, every single time he shoots. I am really curious about how many people actually started playing this game again. Once the game was, quote, unquote, fixed. I mean, like, you know, you guys know what I mean. Waypoint marked. UAV 
No, bro, that would be nasty. Oh my god. <laughs> 